Hi, in this tutorial, we are going to speak about command that is called thread and we can find it in future command manager below call wizard. Before we start to draw the standard TNAT and the vault for this tutorial, click that subscribe button and stay tuned. Open new SOLIDWORKS document and start new sketch on top plane and create the profile of TNAT. The profile looks something like this. T profile. Add dimension. 25. 8. 15. Add relation between this point and this point here. Vertical. And relation between this line and this line. Collinear. Also add dimension between these two lines 18 exit the sketch go in extrude both base command and extrude the profile for 29 millimeters here is our profile for tnat now we'll make a hole on top surface sketch and make a hole in center of the tnat to make this hole in center i will add relation between this point and this point here vertical we are looking the part from top it has to be vertical and one more relation between this line between this point and this point horizontal also at dimension for this point it has to be 10.9 millimeters exit the sketch and go in future use extruded cut use this sketch and extrude the hole Now I will use command chamfer and select these edges. Before we click OK, change this dimension 0.5 and click OK. Before we make the thread, I want to make the start point of the thread. To do that, I will draw on uh, this face here and start the sketch. Use one central line and make it 10 millimeters. Exit the sketch. Now go in future in thread menu. Select the hole that we want to make the thread. Here we can add length of the thread and here we can add the start of the thread for start of the thread i will select this point here this is m12 so already selected cut thread metric tab because we want to make the thread inside of the cylinder and click ok And here is our thread. We can hide this sketch and we will save this file. Note one, because I already have other. Click OK and open new SOLIDWORKS document. Start to sketch on front plane make one cylinder circle sorry make it 12 millimeters and go in future extrude it 100 millimeters click ok 
before we make the thread for this cylinder, we're going to sketch again on front plane, sketch, make one polygon, it has to be six sides and make it 90 millimeters. Exit the sketch, go in future, extrude it 8 millimeters, click OK. Now sketch on this face, make one circle to be tangent to the lines. Go extrude cut, flip side. If you see the this arrow, change the side. Also, draft on 50 millimeters and click OK. I will do the same thing for this side. Sketch one circle, tangent, extruded cut. Flip side, the arrow change the side, draft 15 degree and OK. Here is our half ball. We need just straight now. To make straight, I will go again in straight that we can find in future command manager below hold wizard. I will select this circle here, make offset 35 millimeters and I will make the thread 70 millimeters. Now because the thread is on outside of the cylinder, we are going to change type of the thread and we are going to make it metric die. Again M12. 1.25 cut thread and that's all click ok and here is our bolt go file save as bolt 1 click save we build the document now we are going to make assembly from these two parts Go in file, make assembly from part, bolt here, insert component, tnut here, and that's it. I will add just one relation or mate. Go in mechanical mates, screw. Select this face here on T nut and this face here on screw. Also, I want to add one more relation between this face here and this face here. Go in mate again, advancing mates, distance. Select this face. And this face, minimum distance is 36 millimeters and maximum distance is 70 millimeters. Click OK. Thanks for watching. Click subscribe. See ya.